Hi Leo, welcome to my channel. This reading for today, Leo, this is a love reading. This is a love message for the Leo sign. Let us see what is happening towards you. What is the message that is meant for you to know and ready for you to know? This is a message of love. This is a love reading. This is a love message. Thank you so much, Leo, for coming back. Thank you so much for being here. Guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the bell, click the bell now and click subscribe. This reading for today is a love message. Let, let us see. We'll be looking into um, how your person feels about you. How they think about you and what is the future of your connection, okay? I want you to think of your person. I want you to visualize them and we'll tap into their energy. And let's get a love message for Leo. You have the Seven of Swords. All of, I mean, these are 78 cards, you know. <laughs> Why the Seven of Swords? Um, I'm really getting like this is a long distance relationship or connection. Um, you possibly break up with this person right now. There's definitely some sort of shady energy between the two of you, okay? We're tapping into, you know, seven of swords. This is deceitful. This is playing hard to get. It could be an actual third party. Yeah, Empress card. But the thing is, it's possible that you guys are separated, disconnected. They could not get over you. Um, this person could not forget you. They couldn't. They couldn't forget you. They couldn't get over you. There's something about you, Leo, that you could be dating a player or someone who's really on and off, you and then on. There's something, some, there's a pattern in here. It could be you and then they could always come back to an ex and then you again for some of you guys. But I'm picking up an energy of a very complicated person to love, okay? They're very complicated person to love, but in spite of the complexity of you and this person, it's like a moth in a flame because this person is very sexy. They're very mysterious and they're very... The way they talk and offer you romance and attention is so sweet and so sexy and so mesmerizing. You know, it's, it could be foreign to you, but the way they look at you, the way they talk to you, you will be convinced. And then right after dance, right after that, once you're convinced, then they go back to their shady business. You know, they go back to being, um, yeah, 10 of cups. They really know how to make you happy. They know how to get into your mind, into your heart. They know your weakness. Okay. Queen of Pentacles. They have a soft spot for you, Leo. I would say that um, you have made some sort of unforgettable remarks. Like you are the one who genuinely care. Like they felt that you really genuinely care and love them. But the thing is, they are not done with a player attitude. You're dealing with someone who, they're like a bachelorette, 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 bachelor, bachelor, yeah, sorry. And also, it's possible that this person, they've been through a long-term relationship. And imagine you have unleashed a person who's been tied up in a, in a long-term relationship. So they... They're out of the dog. The lion is out in the cage. Yeah. Hangman, they've been in a long-term relationship or they've been, I don't know, if there's a glow up, this person is just starting. You you met this person at the wrong time. Um, I believe in the past, this person is really romantic. They're very loving. They're very loving, romantic, and loyal. Someone, something break their heart. That's why this person is acting like a wild um, player. 
they will regret this Leo I'm telling you they will they will definitely regret this attitude they're wasting their time you know hangman they're wasting their time they're wasting their youth you know yeah four of swords um I'm seeing this month a huge transformation or revelation from this person four of swords um it's just you know it's it's a feeling it's a reading where um it's so sad that you have to experience the low vibe and the high vibe energy from them like it's it's a reading where they gave you all the love in the world and they also take it away so they put you in a pedestal and they also push you so you you've got that you know hyper love and then down rock bottom negative level kind of from zero to ten this month is a very transformational month for this person you know four of swords this person is now deciding to kind of slow down um like what i told you this person is from a player to a lover yeah i'm kind of picking up this energy of being a player to a lover yeah six of swords now this person is walking away from that immaturity they're walking away from that they're walking away from their old pattern from their old behavior um four of swords six of swords they're not very proud of what sort of energy that they've shared to you they're not so proud about that leo no ace of wands at the end of this month i'm seeing this person reach out to you um they are scared to reach out actually once this person reach out to you you will be very surprised why they're acting quiet and reserve you know you would even ask them if they're sick or if they're not feeling well because they're not hyper talkative like this person will reach out to you they might use a different number or the way they text to you it's very it's it feels like it's not them that you would pick up maybe this person like you still have an em empathy to them queen of pentacles you still empathize with them knight of pentacles the lover's card i would say um this person um they're done being a victim of heartbreak and they're done looking for a victim to break their heart you know this person is done going wild this person is done acting mad wildly in love because something something happens that they realize that they're broken like and they will never feel whole again if they keep breaking someone's heart like this person and they're very comfortable connecting with you and showing you this side of them lover's card i feel like this is one of your soulmate you have met this person in your past life you've met this person definitely you know they're very homey at home to you maybe your family or friends are very connected but they will connect with you and it's they're very sad they're very sad that they have they're very sad they're very sad to tell you that you know um something has woken up this person there's there's a little bit of problem or issue that they would like to share with you but then you also pick up that okay something is wrong they will they will tell you that i'm done being a player something happened something happened that they will tell you that i'm done being a player yeah look at that something happened yeah something will happen that this person will realize that i don't want to be a player emperor that they would really fix and pull themselves together they've hurt a lot of people look at that look at that look at, not just lovers but i feel like their mother the like their father their mother or someone of a someone one of their relative is not really someone one of their relative i don't know i feel like one of their relative died and someone died or someone something happened tragically connected to them and they realize that life is too short and they should not be playing 
you know, with their life or their health. So I give up. I don't want to be a player anymore. And here I am, Leo. You are the closest to my heart. You're the closest person that, you know, that like they feel close to you, vulnerable to you, drawn to you, good and bad. So they would like to be friends with you. Like this person would even ask you, can you listen to my problem? Yeah, the Hierophant card. They will pour their heart to you. And I think you're so kind to empathize with them. You will pick up that there's so much regret in something that they did. Some sort of karma. Yeah, five of cups. See? This person will connect to you. And they will summarize that I've been mean and bad. And that's the reason why I'm having karma. I'm having karma. And like they want you to witness that they will change. Yeah, the will of fortune. You know, they fall get up fall they are they really want to get up and really make it permanent change so they're coming towards you as a friend and as an ex lover or someone that they really feel connected and comfortable to you they know leo that you would judge them but no one could judge them and care care with them none other than than you there's something with you that they run to you when this happened yeah, I feel like it's going to happen during the eclipse. And I feel like you're very kind and generous to offer your time to listen. Because initially, you're kind of, okay, let's listen. What's the drama? But then you would realize that the story is actually intense. Could be an ex. It's intense. And that you, I have this, you know, I'm, it, I've already experienced it. The, the, you know, I've experienced this. With some of your friends or relatives or maybe ex would desperately come to you and it's still good to empathize empathy you know it's it's it feels good to even just listen i feel like you would listen with the amount of information they will tell you it's it's you would really listen you have a good heart and i think you would listen you would be shocked of what whatever they will tell you and you would also feel like okay now it hits you big time one more yeah Knight of Wands, and um, you would see them transform. You would see this person transform. They will report back to you. You are a very, you, they look at you as someone inspirational. They look they look up to you so much. And um, yeah, it's something of a friendship that might turn into really something serious. But there's a shade, like the darkness of this person is going to fade away. And they want you to witness that. I'm not sure if you're in, into that, Leo, to witness that. But I feel like intuitively you will listen. Like a good soul you are, I think you will listen. And I'm um, good on you, Leo. And um, thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for support. It's a pleasure doing the reading to you guys. I will see you soon. You have a great day. Bye-bye.